these features objective is to create a new channel plan by exploring the RF spectral content being received while scanning the terrestrial or satellite band over a pre-selected channel plan. In this example, we will see how to do this with a terrestrial channel plan, but the process is still the same in satellite band. First of all, we need to set up how we will conduct the exploration process. To do that, we will go to the main settings menu, TV analyzer area, and press on exploration config. Here we need to set up the minimum signal level for the meter to consider that a channel must be added to the channel plan. We have three different thresholds, one for TV digital terrestrial signals, another for TV analog terrestrial signals, and the third one is for FM signals. If the signal found in a specific channel is greater than its corresponding threshold, the meter will try to identify it and demodulate it. Depending on the signal quality, this second step may be unsuccessful, either because the signal quality is insufficient or because the meter did not have enough time to identify the channel. Therefore, we provide a second set of fields in order to configure the number of attempts for the meter to identify and demodulate that given signal. There is one field meant for terrestrial signals and another for satellite signals. We can now move to the TV analyzer mode. First, we will choose our reference channel plan from the tuning menu on the left side of the screen. Now we can unfold the right menu and press on Channel Exploration. The exploration process will start immediately after. You can see a bar showing the exploration progress status below. During the exploration, the Spectrum Analyzer tool cannot be used, even though it is shown on a screen for your reference. Once the process is completed, we can find three different channel identification cases. Channels marked with a green tick. This channel power level is greater than the power level threshold defined in the settings area, and the meter was capable of demodulating and identifying it. Channels marked with a white cross inside a red circle icon. These channels did not meet the power level threshold defined in settings. Channels marked with an orange icon. These channels have met the power level threshold, but the meter could not demodulate and identify them, most likely because their signal quality is not sufficient. Now we can add or erase any of the channels just by clicking for two seconds over them. Once we are satisfied with the final selection of channels, we can press on the Save button. We will be asked to provide a name for the newly created channel plan. If we open the tuning menu, we can see that the channel plan selected is the one we just created. 